Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. I was trying to open the Office package or my Word document, but unfortunately, it's just showing me this tab which is telling me that they are trying to update the Office and I have to wait for that. Alright, I gave it a couple of minutes, but it's still stuck there and my Word document is still not opening. So how we can fix this kind of crazy and weird problem that I'm facing now with the office package? I'm going to show you three or four different methods how to fix it and you can choose any one from them and I'm pretty sure that it will help you to fix this kind of problem. The first method is to open system configuration. For that we just go at start, at start we just type here system configuration once you see the system configuration, you click on it in order to open and it will open your system configuration. You have to click over services. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to disable all the other services and we're going to leave only Microsoft services. For that, I'm going to click over here, hide all Microsoft services and then I'm going to disable all the other services which are secondary and not super important for my computer to run. Based on user inputs, we have seen that this kind of solution has helped many users to fix this kind of weird problem with the Office package. I know sometimes it doesn't make totally sense, but it is what it is. There could be some kind of services that is blocking your Office package to update. Anyway, this is the first method. And if you don't like this one, you can move on to the next one. But based on my experience, this has helped to fix this kind of problem. Once you are done with this disabling, you click over apply and then OK, and then it will ask you to restart, do a restart of the PC, and then you try again if you can open your Office package. The next thing that you have to try is to open CMD. You write at search CMD, and then once you see command prompt, you click with the right of the mouse over there, and then you run as administrator. Over there, you have to run two different commands. One of them is this one. I'll put on the description below this command so you can just copy and paste there like I'm doing. You don't have to suffer to write those commands. You just copy and paste and this command will help you to fix this kind of problems which are related with the office package. It will take some time to do all these checks regarding the DLL files. Don't worry, this will not break anything. It will just try to fix things that, that may be missing on your office package or on your system 32 files. Good, so here we are, the first command was applied, you give it a try, check if your Word application or Excel application now is running, and if not, then you move on to the second command, which will help you to fix again any kind of problems which are related with this kind of issues. So I'm just going to copy and paste it there, once again copy and paste it. To paste it, you just click with the right of the mouse or you just do it Control V and then you will be able to paste this command. Good. Try it and see if it works again after this second command. Now, if neither of these methods didn't work, then you have to go at search and you type there settings. I want to mention that these methods work regardless if you are using Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10 or Windows 11, which is the latest version of Windows. So we search here settings. Once you see settings, you click on it in order to open. And then from the options on the left, you just have to find apps or programs, regardless how it's named. You can search programs by just searching also here programs. And then you can see add or remove programs. And then you will be redirected at this part here, which says which programs are installed. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to search for office package. Let's go ahead and let's search for Office package which is installed in my computer. Here it is. I have two versions. One of them is in English and the second one is in German. I'm going to repair the English version. So we click at these three dots here and then we choose modify. And now what we're going to do, we're going to choose online repair. So we'll have two options. Quick repair which fix most issues quickly without the need of an internet connection. But the second option is more powerful. It will fix all issues, but takes a little longer and requires the internet connection, which I don't think is a problem nowadays. So I'm going to choose this one and I'm going to click over repair and then again repair. And this will fix all the problems that you may have with your office package, which includes this problem with the updates. If this doesn't help, then you have to go and to uninstall the Microsoft Office and then install it again 
and then of course it should work after the installation but before going to that option to uninstall and install please give it a try to these different methods that i showed you on this video and normally it should fix these issues that you may have with your office package in this case which was regarding the updates that were stuck for office package that's all that i wanted to share with you guys today i hope you like this video and please consider subscribing to our channel wish to you all the best thank you